Hey, it's Ted McGrath. So I want to share with you right now the three elements to a good video presentation that actually will get you leads and convert for you in your business. So um, if you like this, number one, um, hit subscribe down below because I release two new videos every single week for free and we'll notify you of it if you subscribe and also comment, give us a thumbs up if you like it. So first and foremost, um, you can shoot videos with an iPhone. And I know it's kind of taboo in certain industries of, wow, I can't, I can't, you know, I have to have it professionally done. Well, I have a professional camera crew, but during COVID, we had to switch to using iPhones like this. And when I first started in my business, my first sales ever that I made online came from an iPhone video like this. So it still works, it's still effective, and in some ways it converts better when we're actually delivering it and I'm using an iPhone just like this. The second thing is, um, if you're gonna do advertising or something of that nature, um, give a headline that has somewhat of a hook to it, meaning when I do an ad, for example, like um, something where I'm giving away a free gift on Facebook or Instagram or YouTube, I'll say something like, um, I wanna share with you the fastest way that I went from 20 clients a month to 2,000 clients a month using a simple video presentation template like this. Now notice what's in there. Number one, it gives contrast in the headline of I went from this to this. So when people understand contrast of like I'm here and now I wanna be here, um, it shows the difference between the two and people go, oh my God, right, there's a difference and obviously I'm here and I wanna be here, I'm paying attention. Um, stats are good too, so if you have any stats that you can share, um, results and credibility get people's attention today. So that's important. And then finally, you know, what's the specific thing that's gonna help me get there? So like the presentation template down below, grab it, right? So notice how it's very specific, it's to the point, it's quick, okay? Um, additionally, you can add in softer things like, you know, how I went from 20 clients a month to 2,000 clients a month using a presentation template like this, and how I was really able to get my message and story out to millions of people and make a massive impact in the world. Okay, so that now speaks more to the contribution desire that people have and sort of the emotional component of, oh, I wanna make a contribution, I wanna make an impact, right? So using words that are not just more rational words of like numbers and stats, but kind of fluctuating back and forth between the uh, numbers of things and the stats of things and the data of things to Ooh, the outcome of things, the impact of things, a little bit of the emotion of things, right? Um, I could even put in there the feelings of, hey, you know, when I first started, I was really struggling and I was frustrated. Emotion, right? Okay, um, real state of how somebody's doing, right? Then once, you know, I got 2,000 new clients a month, I, I was liberated. I mean, I was free for the first time where I realized I could follow my dreams and live my passions, right? Notice those two differences. So, little simple things that you can do to really ramp up your videos. Um, if it's an ad, you just go click the link. If it's content, you can do just what I did to grab people's attention. Um, and then you can get into a little bit of storytelling, you know? People go, well, how do I tell a story online? Um, and nobody wants to hear my story. Well, if your story has contrast of loss to breakthrough, uh, people like that because when people are buying stuff, it's like the loss or the before and the after. Storytelling is like, here's the before, here's the after. So it goes really, really well with marketing. Like when I tell my story, I'm like, yeah, you know, when I was 21 years old, um, I started with a company called New York Life and you know, I, I just chased the money because I thought if I made money, I'd really feel good enough about myself. And uh, my first year in the business, I cracked six figures and that night I OD'd. And I was on the kitchen floor, you know, overdosing from drugs, um, alcohol, and uh, you know, a bag of cocaine. And my soul was coming out of my body. And I woke up the next morning, I was like, wow, that didn't do it. And so then I decided I wanted status, so I chased becoming partner, and five years later, I became one of the top partners for the number one life insurance company in the country, and I had that question, is this really all there is to my life? Now, I could go on and on and tell the rest of the story, but notice in 20, 30 seconds, I'm grabbing attention with loss, questioning, and then I'm leading people to the actual breakthrough, which I didn't get to here, but loss, like over, you know, chasing the money, and that wasn't the answer, and overdosing, and then, oh my God, and then I have more success, and I'm like, is this all there is to my life? Like, what's going on here? Which is like the search that people go through in their lives of like, they're asking themselves a question, and then you, boom, you lead them to the solution in the story. So those are some tips with video presentations. I hope it helps you. Click down below um, to subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up or me a thumbs up. 
and comment if you like this and hope it serves you. See you soon. And you can use an iPhone like this, guys. It's that simple, okay?